What's going on guys, Professionally Amateur here. I'm gonna be teaching you guys today how to replace your radiator drain cock. I had just gotten my water outlet replaced, which was leaking out all the coolant. I got that fixed, came back outside, saw a giant puddle of radiator uh, coolant just sitting on the ground. And so I went to go assess the problem and I saw it leaking out where the radiator plug is. And as you can see, literally it just went and then just cracked right off. I'm what you're gonna need here is a whole lot of tools, needle nose pliers. That's really all you're gonna need. You're gonna need a bucket because if you have any liquid left in there from it leaking, it's all gonna fall right out. So I got the light on for you here. As you can see, it's a little liquid build up right here. Your drainage plug goes in right here. It goes in right there. So I'm on the right side of a Ford Ranger. It is sitting right up in there. It's got a little hump, looks like a submarine in a sense. Little drainage hole right here so that when you pull it out, it does come out indeed right there. Don't know why it's coming out right there too. May have another problem on my hands, I don't know. Basically, I'm just applying pressure. Where am I, there I am. All right, so basically I'm just applying pressure holding it down and twisting it and once it gets loose enough as you can see the green nectar coming out right there what's up you got it figured out here it comes yep there is my coolant and here comes the radiator plug I'm trying to do this with one hand so it's not coming out as well hopefully it don't get splashed but oh oh god just a little update on our project here the stream literally just stopped just missed it on the camera but this is all my coolant fluid we have the new part right here it's getting ready to come out here get a better angle probably just come out yeah, with the rest of a hand if it'll come out oh it does have a stem here we are so not only are we going to show you the removal we're going to show you the reattachment and luckily it has this wing system so it's a lot easier to screw in there we go a lot easier to screw in than the other one was and just like that we have replaced your radiator drain cock <laughs> yeah woo we're out